The Northrop Grumman B-21 Raider is an American strategic bomber under development for the United States Air Force USF, by Northrop Grumman. As part of the Long Range Strike Bomber LRSB program, it is to be an advanced, very long-range, massive heavy payload stealth intercontinental strategic bomber for the USAF, able to deploy conventional and thermonuclear bombs. As of 2021, the bomber was projected to enter service by 2026 to 27. It is to supplement current Rockwell B-1 Lancer, Northrop Grumman B-2 Spirit, and Boeing B-52 Stratofortress bomber fleets in U.S. service, and eventually replace these bombers. At a congressional hearing on 8 June 2021, Darling Costello, the Air Force's Acting Assistant Secretary of the Air Force Acquisition, Technology and Logistics, announced that the first two B-21s were being produced on the manufacturing line at Plant 42 in Palmdale, California. Six B-21s are being constructed as of February 2022. The first B-21 was transferred to a calibration facility in March 2022. In March 2022, Air Force Secretary Frank Kendall II discussed the prospect of a bomber drone to operate alongside the bomber. However, this proposal has subsequently been rejected due to insufficient cost savings in having such a big platform unmanned. In May 2022, the Air Force said that they expected the maiden flight of the B-21 to take place in 2023. In September 2022, the Air Force stated that the B-21 will be debuted in early December 2022 in Palmdale, California. Northrop Grumman, the aviation defense corporation behind some of the United States' most advanced aircraft, stated that it would reveal the B-21 Raider bomber in early December. The stealth bomber, externally similar to the B-2 Spirit bomber, is projected to be the stealthiest aircraft ever produced and will be an enormously vital asset for American nuclear deterrent. The B-21 is the most sophisticated military aircraft ever developed and is a product of pioneering innovation and technological excellence, Doug Young. Sector Vice President and General Manager at Northrop Grumman Aeronautic Systems said in the corporate release. The Raider displays the devotion and expertise of the thousands of individuals working every day to create this aircraft, Young added. Northrop Grumman is proud of our partnership with the U.S. Air Force as we deliver the B-21 Raider, a sixth-generation aircraft optimized for operations in highly contested environments. Tom Jones, Corporate Vice President and President at Northrop Grumman Aeronautic Systems said in the announcement. Though both the B-21 Raider and the B-2 Spirit are flying wing-type aircraft, lacking a typical tail assembly, the newer Raider bomber is projected to be a far stealthier aircraft. Unlike the B-2, the Raider will not require specific climate-controlled hangars to maintain its stealth coating. Officials have claimed before that the B-21 stealth capabilities will be two generations beyond the B-2s. Ultimate procurement numbers are uncertain, however. The Air Force may ultimately opt to acquire 80 to 100 B-21s, and perhaps as many as 200. Northrop Grumman revealed that six B-21 test aircraft are in various stages of final construction in Palmdale, California. Northrop Grumman and the U.S. Air Force announced in May that the B-21 maiden flight is anticipated for 2023. The precise schedule of the maiden flight will be contingent on ground test outcomes. The business claimed that the reveal will take place at Northrop Grumman's Palmdale location during an invitation-only event. Though Northrop has produced many computer-generated photos of the strategic bomber and a commercial that displayed a cloth-draped B-21 fuselage, photographs of the aircraft have not been released. Given the importance of the Raider program, most parts of the new bomber have been cloaked in secrecy, including financial details relating to the project. However, available measurements and evidence show that the program is progressing forward according to budget and at a rather swift rate, considering the B-21's advanced nature.
Though Northrop will announce the B-21 shortly, the stealth aircraft is not scheduled to make its first flight until next year, and the bomber is slated to enter service with the U.S. Air Force in the mid-2020s.